Hey, it's Sabrina with Wildlife X Team, and this is the last video about the most social animals. Um, elephants, they actually talk to each other even if it's in a secret tone. Not only do elephants communicate with each other, sometimes they do it in tones humans can't even hear. After years of observing elephants in the world, researchers have found that elephants use more than 70 kinds of vocal sounds and 160 visual and tactical signals, expressions, and gestures. They can mean anything from let's go to help I'm lost. The latter is often uh, done in a low frequency that will travel for miles through forests letting um, the pachyderms connect without alerting other animals to their presence. Cuttlefish show their true colors. It's pretty normal for us to be selective uh, about which part of ourselves we want to reveal. We show one side to be a boss, for instance, and another to be a best friend. But cattlefish can literally split their bodies into different patterns to accomplish different things at the same time. One half of its body may be designed uh, to attract a mate, while the other half is completely different, designed to conceal itself from predators. Spiders know that millions of legs are better than eight. What's more terrifying than the thought of thousands or millions of spiders working together toward one common goal? Not much, but a few are as brilliant, are as brilliant. Uh, certain species of spiders called social, spi social spiders act in unison to create massive webs that catch way more prey than one little web would ever catch on its own. In 2007, spiders spun webs that span 200 yards in a Texas park. Uh, penguins actually get in sync. Not only do emperor penguins huddle together for warmth, but they also make very specific synchronized movements, movements that further the effort uh, to retain, retain heat. Thoroughly, every 30 to 60 seconds, all, pe all the penguins in one row of the huddle move somewhere from two to four inches in the same direction.